guys, would you like to know how to insert a video in your web page? Here we are. Yeah, do you want to see how the video runs here? <laughs> you're smart enough to observe here that I put the video in a table and this table got three rows the first one I used to uh, give a title to the uh, uh, video and the last one I just used it to describe about the video and you see here I put the video towards the right side in the web page now shall we start let's go to expression web oh would you like to see what is the skill set we're gonna learn in this video so we are inserting video using expression web 4 and in this we will insert a video in the web page and for inserting we use um, a tag that's called video tag we will learn uh, how to use this as well and along with this video tag we have uh, two attributes we call them one is called src in the sense it is source of the video and controls to set the controls uh, for the video to run on web page now let's come to our expression web here now let's open new html document and save it with the name I'd like to take here uh, video I'd say okay now I'm gonna add one background uh, some color it's up to you you can even add a background picture uh, as a wish yeah I'm gonna add this one here fine now I'll insert the table files you know very well how to insert a table in my previous lessons i guess you watch them to know to learn how to insert a table now here are three rows i'm taking and a single column and here i want to just take the width of the table to be 60 percent and uh, alignment is the center but floating is towards the right side and when the a table floats towards the right the text comes uh, towards the uh, left okay so borders I'm gonna just take a border uh, you can even have a thick border thin border it's up to you one pixel I'm taking over here and if I want to just give a color to it just a, a max I'll just give one uh, back that's it okay put there and this is my table got three rows yeah now I'm going to add the first row uh, to be the title from here I'll pick it's already there you can just even type in there in the uh, row here and I will put it in the center and if I want I will add the background color uh, separately the background color is here uh, some color like a purple sorry I'll just go for another color which dominates okay apply done now you see here uh, one more thing uh, I can even set the uh, the size of the cell the second one I'm setting here specifically because i'm going to put that the video 100 percent width because it is going to fill it uh the table and here uh it is 60 percent height okay apply and okay for the second one now you see the third one i'm going to bring in there uh my this some view about it just i will copy paste in the new one here I am and you can put it in the center if you want put that in the center and if you want to give a color to it as well go to the cell properties and give a color background color there uh, 
any color you like or you can put the same color as well yeah that now i'm gonna type in uh some title like or heading we call it we can just type in this one i'll copy paste this same heading there uh like here i'm gonna type in yep it is here and even i would like to say uh hi and i will type in i am trying video upload okay when you just decrease the size of it just select everything and come here just reduce it and if you want to change the color of it as well just you can change from here go to the font and here uh, any color you'd like to you can change the color okay done now I'm gonna just create one CSS file to set the uh, table in the right position for that I have to go here and take CSS new and save this as a video as well and make sure you're saving in the same folder now clicking there and come here to the new style I'm gonna set the table in position so it should be the table as a selector and come here to the box okay and put there 50 is the margin uh, around the table for all and come to the table here and table layout is fixed okay it won't move uh, from the place okay done that's it this one save and we're gonna attach this style sheet to this HTML for that what we have to do go to uh, attach browse and um, here this is a CSS file and okay okay see can you see that it came down save it now we're gonna attach uh, the video click in there click in there and come to the code here and where is uh, the cursor blinking see can you see here the cursor is blinking here and just enter from there by deleting it automatically it gets deleted and video we're gonna start video a space width is equal to 100% because the the video has to fill in the cell right for this it is and src is equal to the source of the video is my video name is robots uh, mp4 you can just modify the name to make it very simple uh, because uh, if it's complicated it's very difficult to spell it here and uh, the thing is the video you have to have in your folder as well and here you see I'm going to add controls uh one term here to see the controls over there uh, on my video to just start stop and also i'm gonna now end the video like this see that this is only one line we added for the video have a look at that only this line we have to add for the video insert the video in particular cell perfect now save it here we're gonna just run this in web browser go to the file and preview in the browser look at that now we can run this here <laughs> Yes, uh, my tips are here. Keep the video very short, like max 30 minutes, uh, 30 seconds, sorry, not 30 minutes, it's 30 seconds. And uh, one more thing, you can add the title over there. 
yep we're gonna add that one and this video should be in your folder be careful keep in your folder you see here i kept the uh, video the short video in this my uh, folder where i'm working okay and keep the name of the uh, video short and what is the magic here only this is single line here uh the code in the code view we added to run the video now let's add the title uh of the web page for that we have to come here can you see here uh title here my video you can add here save it and you can see in the web browser just refresh you can see here on the top my video is the video we inserted